at um, Claire. This is in The Guardian, the climate protest, because obviously there's, there's more and more stuff going on in London at the moment, which <laughs> a lot of people are going to say, well, it's London, we don't care. But nevertheless, it's significant. It is significant. And you've got Extinction Rebellion um, activists blocking bridges in London, I think Vauxhall Bridge, uh, Westminster Bridge and Blackfriars Bridge. Uh, protesting over uh, climate change, which, you know, is their right to a peaceful, peaceful protest. But when it stops people going about their daily lives, it stops, especially on Westminster Bridge, that's one of the main routes into St Thomas's Hospital. Mm. Um, I, you know, I'm really against this kind of thing. Have a peaceful protest all you like. Please don't disrupt other people's lives. If you they don't, do but have if, to get off. If you're not disruptors... No one's going to listen to you. But you can be disruptive. You can go and be disruptive elsewhere. You can go and actually <laughs> campaign outside the buildings which hold that power. Why block a bridge which is going to affect normal people who don't have... Because it gets rights. us talking about it. We wouldn't really be well, talking about I it mean, if they just did it outside an office problem? block. Is, is that the problem, though, mm. is that we are giving them all that airtime? I don't think gluing yourself to, uh, you know, one of the departments in London or an oil company's reception... Well, how is that going to help? It's actually just going to make people angry and turn against them. So I just think it's a bit counterproductive.